Hello YouTube, thought we'd do another video here. We're going to do a distance test uh, of the modified Redivus RT97 repeater. And if you've been following my videos, um, I took out the stock duplexer and then we got it hooked up to this duplexer and this amplifier. Yes, this is not ideal layout but i'm just going to show you the way it is to do a quick distance test if i remember right in the video that i tested this it does about 25 watts as you can see that is hooked up um, then we're using like i said the other duplexer it's in the same setup as the uh, stock uh, video that i did the antenna is on the same pole the only thing difference is there is leaves now. So we got to keep that in mind that we have a whole bunch of leaves. And if you look here, I'm right next to a tree that's taller than my antenna with, with a lot of leaves. So that could easily interfere or perhaps cut back on my distance. So I got to keep that in mind. Um, what we're running here is a... Uh, a simplex repeater this is going to record and play back and obviously it being that close there's not you know it won't be any um loss per se i got this handheld set on low power because like i say the repeater's right there we want to record the audio and play it back so i'll be able to see how it sounds when it's playing back so that's the plan um so that is it right there and i think like i said i think that does about 25 watts ish something like that i'll post the links to the other modified the videos showing how to modify this um, like i said this is not an ideal layout i'm just using the cables i have on hand and it's a tight fit and it, everything is just kind of running out the hole like i said in that one video um you'll look at the other videos and you'll see how i kind of modified this but but at any rate that's what we're doing uh, I'll be using a handheld to test this, just like the other video. I want to keep everything the same. Um, so we'll go ahead. I'm going to put you on pause. We're going to go to the first location, and we'll be right back. Okay, we're at our first location, which is 0.8 miles approximately as the crow flies. Let's go ahead and do a test. One, two, three, four, radio check, radio check. <laughs> Sounding pretty good. So at least we we got to the first location and everything is looking like it the way it should be. Um, we'll go to the second location and I don't know if I'm gonna hit every location um, as I said in my other videos. Uh, you know, I got one that's 1.05 miles away, one at 1.5 miles away. I may skip the in-between ones and just get to the, like, 1.5. Um, I'll let you know when I get to the location. But this location is 0.8 miles away from the repeater as the crow flies, according to Google Maps. And what I mean by um, as the crow flies, obviously, we're not going by mileage road mileage we're going sign straight um distance straight sight is what i mean by as the crow flies or as a bird flies so at any rate let's go to the next one and i'll be right back all right we're at location two now which is 1.05 miles away um we are the car's pointed in the direction of the antenna or towards the repeater. On the first location, the car was not pointed towards the repeater. Now it is. And we're going to try it here once. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. I got a feeling the leaves and the trees with all the leaves are really going to interfere with this. 
Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. I know in the other video it was fall or early spring, I guess to say, and there was no leaves if I remember right in the videos. And I was doing really, I could go pretty pretty good distance. Um, so I'm not too surprised. I mean, if you look at the other videos and you can, you'll see that there was no leaves at all. And that's really cut me back, um, which, you know it's good to know I mean now you know if, if you put your antenna up next to a tree and it's gonna have a whole bunch of leaves and it's really gonna cut you back um, I'm gonna try one more time radio check one two three four radio check one two three four Ooh. well we're gonna keep going um, we're gonna go to the next location I'm gonna go a little farther you know different directions you know can make a difference too so let's try the next one I'll be right back all right there guys we're back we're at location 3 which is 1.37 miles away from their repeater let's see if we can uh, even <laughs> even make it radio check one two three four Try it again. Radio check one two three four. We're radio check one two three four. I'm hitting the repeater as you can tell, but it's the I can't copy what it's saying when it when it's coming when it's playing it back. So um, again, look at the. I mean, I got. <laughs> I got trees and leaves and everything you can imagine. Um, so I'm not totally surprised. I should probably do this exact same test when there's no leaves to get more accurate reading. But the nice thing about doing it this way is you get to really see what happens when the trees get leaves and your antenna's being blocked. Um, so this is kind of a good video to really show that. Um, we'll keep going just for the heck of it. I'm not expecting a lot of distance because of the environment. Let me try it one more time. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I'm, I'm hitting the repeater, but I, I, it's not recording my audio so my audio must be really weak coming in and the program can't pick it up um but and we're 1.37 miles away i'm gonna go out on a limb and i'm gonna go a little further out i don't want to have this be an hour video so we're gonna go a little further out i know you're probably thinking what's the point well why not i'm already in the vehicle let's go ahead and and kind of wander around and see what we come up with um i'll put you on on pause and we'll talk to you in the next location okay guys we're at location oh what number are we on here four i believe and this is going to be 2.91 miles away which is i know further you're probably thinking why keep going further well you just never know Let's try and see what happens. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Well, I'm, I'm hitting the repeater. Again, the audio, I can't make out the audio. My audio probably going into the repeater is, is probably real low. Um, so it's, it, you know, uh, but I am hitting the repeater. Let me try it again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Testing, testing. Yeah, yeah. So, um, 
I, I know some people are going to say, well, what's the point? You, you should you should test it the same conditions as your other videos. Well, yes, that's true, but here's the thing. At least now you get to see how this works um, when there's leaves and the environment changes. Uh, this is how important it is to get your antenna up in the air as much as possible. Um, so I, you can look at it both ways, I guess, is what, what my point is. Um, all right, I'm going to go to probably one more location, a little bit closer, and we'll see what happens. I'll be right back. Hey, right, guys. All right, we're at location, I think, five. Losing track here. This is about two miles away. Um, let's give it a try and see what happens. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Oh, I might have been hitting the repeater. Interesting. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Nope. I can't even key up the repeater from here. Usually you hear that at the end of the transmission when you unkey. Radio check. One, two, three, four. Nope, oh, there we go. That time I hit the repeater, but I'll bet you it, it's barely. Let me try it one more time. Radio check one two three four five. Oh, it's yeah, it's I can't ew, I can't even I, I might even keying up the repeater. And that's weird because I'm about two miles away. The last location, which was um, two point nine one miles away, I was hitting the repeater pretty pretty consistent. You couldn't really make out the audio and playback. But, so obviously in this direction, there's a big difference in single loss. Let me try it one more time. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Radio check, one, two, three, four. Nope, at that time I didn't even hit the repeater. Um, I gotta move up here, it looks like, of course. Unbelievable, I tell you. Okay, let's park right here should be okay here okay at any rate sorry about that um so and by the way i'm using a handheld radio so i'm not using a mobile um i'm gonna put you on pause this is our last location i'm gonna put you on pause i'm gonna go back to the repeater and i'm going to show you what it looks like how it's set up and maybe you understand why the reception ain't like it was before i'll be right back Okay guys, I want to show you a better view here of what I'm up against. As you can see, my antenna is right next to a tree that's got a ton of leaves. It's taller than the antenna, so it's a miracle I even went a mile uh, to begin with. But that's, that makes a big difference, so that's, that's how we're set up. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please post them down below and please subscribe. Thank you.